This is me making my Plinko project with an adult, which is safe. And uh, this is me sanding my triangles for the Plinko board. And I sand the wood to make it more smooth and clean. Before I was quite scared, but now I'm getting used to it. Now I'm putting glue onto my Plinko base so I can put my triangles on so the Plinko bounces off and doesn't go into a straight line. And I'm putting the glue, this is super glue, so it, you shouldn't put your finger and touch it, otherwise you'll stick your fingers together. And after that, I use my pen to mark the measurements perfectly to see where the nails should be. And also these woods are scrap woods, so I don't use the new woods, I use the ones that my dad doesn't need anymore. And I also use paperboard. And now I'm marking the, the spots where I am going to later drill for my nails to be. These are the holes where my nails are going to be. And this is me drilling into the board so I can put, I can like hammer the nails in and they shouldn't be so large, otherwise the nails will fall off and they'll go loose. And we shouldn't put our fingers near the driller because it, will, it might cause some injuries. They have to be in the exact center of the ruler lines. Basically the holes that I put. And the thing also gives out a weird squeaky sound which is very weird. <laughs> This is a very fun project. I, even though I spent a whole day to do it, it was very fun. And also this is me using the air nail gun, which is used to secure the wood together. And it sounds very scary, and it also looks very hard to do, but it's actually very easy. Just don't point it at someone's body. And I'm sanding my things again, so they're extra smooth. <laughs> and also I'm cutting my wood for the top part and my, my name, my Plinko board name. This is when it's almost finished. I have to draw and I have to add it into the thing. And I use watercolor paper and watercolor to do this landscape with the whale and the dolphins. This shows that all creatures live in harmony and we should follow them and like live in harmony too. And even though unicorns don't exist, I think it is very adorable so I decided to draw it onto my piece. Hello, this is my Plinko and it's a game where you have to like guess where the marble will drop. My friends will help me paint one, two, three, and four. So this is how we play it.